Yo, 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 my Star Citizens and Noob Gamers. Welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen with me, Menix. And in today's episode, we're in PTU, Wave 1, 3.18. So, this is me on 3.18. So, in today's video, I'm not going to try and stay on too long. I don't want to hog it for other people. Uh, but I just want to have a look around. The main thing I want to look at is the refactor, the cargo refactor. Um, I know a lot of people are doing the Vulture and the um, the Reclaimer and doing Salvage, but I want to look more at space. I want to look more at the Cargo Refactor and the Hull A, my Hull A. So that's what I'm going to look at and then maybe do another video on the other stuff later on. So let's see how this goes. Been looking forward to this. It's been taking me a long time to get on board. Whee! No, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. Wee! See you later, guys. Let's let's try that again. <laughs> oh, normally I don't even go through them, but I thought no, it's just a little bug. Guys, man, I'm in. What's wrong with you guys, man? I ain't falling for that again. Yeah, well done. Hey man, what are you doing in my lift? Come on, I dare you. I dare you. See you later, man. <laughs> See you later, man. <laughs> I don't know where he went. Let's see if he died. I think he died. As you can tell me now, he died. Oh, look at my own chest, man. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Like that. That's the little line to it now. That's pretty cool, that's the line, look at this. The move all button. It has the move all button, guys. Yes, I. What? Well, so here we go, guys. So, so I um, I wanted to work on. They're all still standing on the things. Then I wanted to work on um, the cargo refactor. That's the one I really wanted to look at. There is the salvage and there is the racing over at Orison, but I really wanted to work on the cargo resalvage. Uh, the cargo refactor is what I really wanted to look at. Next 
So, yeah, that's what I want to look at. So, what I had to do in the end, all day I've been trying to get in, and then I've spent a good two hours or something in the space, in the TESA spaceport, because for some reason there was an issue where it put all my ships in Orison, but put me in Lawville. And when I put a claim in for my ships, it counted down, and then when the timer finished, it just said claim again. It didn't say retrieve. And nobody would give me a lift over to Orison, so I had to literally delete my PTU and create a new one. And it looks like it may have worked this time, because when I just checked my ships a minute ago, they um, didn't have red um, things on them anymore, so... All my button bindings are there. So let's see. If these have retrieve on them, then I'm good. And we should be good to go. Have a look. What we got? Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval Yay, system. Yay! We're all good guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out my hull air. And I'm going to do vehicle my... Selected. Stand by. Uh, my, my... Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Hang seven. So I'm going to do my normal cargo run because there's a cargo refactor that I want to try out. That's the main thing I'm really looking forward to. I may do other videos. We'll see. But the, the cargo refactor is the main one, basically. Hang a seven. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not doing that again. Hang a seven. Doing that. There we go. Yay! We finally got a ship. I've only been on this all day trying to get a ship. For some reason, it's just stupid. It was like, and then like nobody would give me a lift, so that was just. Even worse. So I like that little. Yeah, that was pretty cool. So how much money have I got? I've got 120,000, so it should be enough to at least try a run of my cargo. And um, yeah, we'll see, see what goes from there. And there is some delivery, oh, racing missions. They're pretty cool. Look at that. Man, cool. I'm gonna have to definitely give one of those a go at some point. Maintenance, removal service, bio waste, bounty on the investigation, research, search, delivery, personals. So, yeah, so let's um, just do this cargo refactor. I mean, the colours look really richer as well. I don't know if it's like anything to do with this, the refactor, the rethink of it. But the, the colours look a lot different as well. Let's do this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do my normal run. I'm going to go into here and I'm going to go over to Art Corp and to Lyria. And in Lyria we've got... I mean, this doesn't look brilliant, does it? <laughs> uh, we've got the orphanage and I'm just going to head over to the orphanage and pick up some, like, um, some stuff. There we are. You are clear to launch. to go into my options and set my key bindings out maybe 
Let's just make sure my customization, controller profiles, Tony, and then, oh, controller profiles, Tony, uh, keyboard, mouse, and then load. Hopefully that does what we need. Turn to game. modifier doesn't seem to be working for some reason. Please proceed to assigned landing bay. Okay, let's let's do this. Why does it feel left handed? Maybe it's because I'm in...
knows what's going on here. Everything doesn't feel right. In my controls. Yeah, it doesn't feel right for me. Return options. Comes. I don't know why it's doing it. Controls, mouse, gamepad, key bindings. I'm just going to reset it. For now, game control, reset to defaults. Lord, and just do that. Let's see if that does anything. Quantum travel complete. No, still the same. This is hard because I'm not used to doing the because I'm trying to steer this um, in a different way, basically. That's the thing. by doing keyboard bits as well. That's a red door this time on here. I like that. I like that it's a red door.
Colors are a lot richer, seems. Colors are a lot, lot richer. That's how this goes. There we go, first time out of our ship. See what we've got going on here. I like that it's got a red door this time, it's normally blue. I like that, close, changes. Taking its time. There we are, all right, so what we got in here? Let's have a look. Quick look at this box. No, I'm going to show us what's in the box. Okay. okay, maybe you are. Local. Local. Maybe it's because I'm not stood next to it now. No. Okay. We'll look over here, see what we've got. Blue. Call, see what we've got in over here. See if this move all works, see if it lets me in. So, oh, there we are. We've got a local there, and we've got arms. Um, yeah, okay. So we can't move all then? Oh, we can move all. There we go. Move all. Yes, that's pretty cool. So we got some arms on there. Get that on as well. So the move all button works. Yes, that's pretty cool. Have a look what we got on this one. In the local. And then the boots maybe. I don't need all this stuff, so I'm not gonna be bothered with it. But there we are. So, looks like someone's delivered some drugs here. Here we go. Here's the new commodities list. Hey, look at this. This is what I've been waiting for. We're at the orphanage. And then the whole area. So it shows you what's in demand. No demand. Cannot sell. And then what they've got in stock. So, in stock they've got this stuff and it's e time I'm looking at 50 SCU max inventory and then they've got the out of stock stuff so so if I go to my inventory miscal air and then I can get so it's 8.5 per unit 50 units and I can get 14 is 119k I've only got 120 if I can get 14 SCU of it and can I take that down yeah can I um, can I write in here so it's a little bit better on the lit on this so there's 50 SCU of it in here and I can take 14 because that's all the money I've got but I'm liking this new look. That's pretty cool. And then it shows me. Yeah, I like that. Cool. What? Invalid parents there. What are you on about? What are you on about? Let's buy that. And let's confirm. PH invalid parents there. What does that mean? So, oh, look, you can look at the different categories of your cargo grid. Is that cargo grid? And see what's in demand and cannot sell. So, why can't I buy some of this then? Why is it failing? 
on me. Is it because my thing isn't out? Invalid parents there. I don't get it. The orphanage. Also showing what's in demand. Oh, this is cool. What's in demand here? To sell. So I can't buy nothing here. I've got to select my ship, my hull air. Right, so let's let's come off here then. I like how it says that. I, I like that where it says that 100. What's it care? So let's use this again. So we want to select the hull here. Right, select cup subcategory. Cargo grid. And then grab the ETAM. Bye. Confirm. Invalid parents there. I don't get it. Not let me buy, guys. Going on with it. Right, it's not letting me buy. It's not even let me buy one or two. What about waste? Can I buy waste? P hit invalid parents there. Cargo grid. Do I have to click on any of these? What's going wrong here, yeah, guys? I really don't. I like the look of this, but I don't know what's going on with it. Why it's going wrong. I wonder if it's because my thing isn't open. My um, So he's got my hull air there. Did you see that? So I'm wondering, do I need to open my hull air? That'd be cool if I have to do that because normally it would just do it for me. But if I've got to do it, that's going to be mad because that means you've got to make sure it's done before you land. And it won't do it for you. And that'd be awesome because it'd be more realistic. I didn't think it was a bit silly. Like, it just opened it for you and then it put it on. And you'd come out and it'd still be going out. Alright, let me just lift off a little bit. On. Oh. I like that then. Launch sequence complete. That was pretty cool as well. Like that. Right, so down here somewhere we've got the thing to open up. Shut down. Extend spin dump. That's what we want. Let that do that. And then I'll land again. down land here now right so now my thing is open will that now let me buy I'm hoping that that is the case and then I'm, I'll be actually happy with that because it makes it a bit more realistic and you know that's what we that's what we're looking for yeah, ultimately here guys so that'd be amazing if that happened if that is the case Let's go. They're open.
I like these red doors. Pretty cool. Are in different colour doors. Right, so let's try this again, guys. Let's try it again. So I'm gonna select the hull here, which is here, showing here. Subcargo again, I'm just gonna put cargo grid. Can I do anything with this? I don't think I can. And then let's see. Bye. Confirm. Wow. <laughs> yes, I like that. I do like it. There we are, so. Um, I think my ship's bouncing around. Uh, yeah, I like that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. So you have to have it open first. You have to have it open first. Is my ship bouncing around? No, it looks fine. Yes, I like that. That's, um, that's cool for me, that. Uh, I like that. I do like that. <laughs> so they've got some good things on it. I, I like them. I don't like that my ship's bouncing around. That's not, that's not, uh, that's, <laughs> that's not the best thing. Hey guys, come on. Stop with the bouncing. Way my ship is bouncing. My ship is bouncing and things are coming off it. Oh man. Oh, maybe it's because I was close to this. Maybe, I don't know. There's a button around here. Let me, gr let me grab it. I get in. Is it just going to kill me? Ah. Yeah, hopefully that'll let me in. Maybe it's just because I was close to this stuff here. Who knows? Right. Let's have a look. Ah, it stops now. There we are. So I'm having difficulties with my flying because it seems like my flying controls have, have all changed for some reason. I don't know why. Oh. Okay, we'll just go out like that then. So it looks like the ETAM has a different look as well in this. I don't know if that's that's normal or not, but let's go. Let's roll this up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and sell this at um, Hurston. Oh, well, the planets are back now. And in Hurston, there's the uh, reclamation that I'm looking for around here somewhere there it is that's the uh, reclamation I'm going to set the route to that yeah there we are and um, yeah I'm going to head up to that I don't know why my controls are out maybe the, the arrow that I've got in the middle that is almost like it's the um, it's like I'm not in flight mode or something. It's almost like I'm in a different mode. So, we'll see. But it, 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 it shows where we're at. I really like that. <laughs> I just got rid of... Oh, I literally just got rid of all my flares. <laughs> I just literally got rid of all my flares. <laughs> I might actually even go in anyway, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna have to turn this off and then back on, I think. <laughs> ah, bugs are bugs, it's alright, it's all good. Quantum into it. There we are. Engaged. Just a bit slow, I think. But yeah, so that 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 cargo refactor I really liked, and the fact that you had to open up the spine was was good. Like that. Quantum travel complete. Boom. Right. So. I'm, um, my thoughts up to here are, um, with the cargo refactor itself, I'm really happy with the cargo refactor, it looks like there's more to it, uh, I'd like to get a proper good look at it, proper when I'm feeling like it's, it's, 
you know, easier for me. And with it, because I've got, because the, there is some bugs in it, and and I understand the bugs are going to be there. I know we're in testing, uh, but this it's making it harder, like my controls not being the right, right, uh, right. Even though I'm copying my controls settings over, like my on my pad, it just feels wrong. Like my rolls uh, instead of being um, my trip, my bumper button and and left and right stick. It's uh, left stick. It's on the right stick and. Or should I say bumper button and right stick? It's just it's like almost like the bumper button's constantly stuck in already. So yeah, it's it, I like the cargo refactor. That's brilliant, uh, and the fact that I open I had to open the spine was really good. That's how we want. That's how I want it anyway. I want it. I want that realism, and so so I'm loving that part of it. I definitely want to give other things a go, like the buggy racing and the um, uh, salvage but I'm not going to do all that in one video because it, it'd be selfish when other people want to get on and have a go and so I'm going to obviously once I've done this I'm going to log off and, and give people that chance but I want to see what I can make at the moment normally I would make normally I would make um a decent amount of money. I want to see what I get. So I'll spend 120,000 and we'll see what we get from that in the end. But I do like this cargo refactor. I am I am happy with that. Uh, I just want to have a go more now when we um, when I feel com when I feel comfortable and the, and the controls are back to normal for me because it's it's just dis disorientating like the controls being wrong for me. I don't like it. So obviously I'll try and log in again when I can and see if the controls are better. But I spent so much time today messing around, trying to get in the, from the queues. And then once I did get in, for some reason putting my ships in Orison and me in Lawville. And when I did a claim, it came back and said, once the timer had run down, it just was like, uh, claim again it just had the claim button on again so I, um, I couldn't do nothing I did ask people to give me if they could give me a lift over to law and to over to Orison and nobody could give me nobody nobody answered so which was a shame so then I had to d delete my whole character there was no character reset on the thing on the PTU site itself there was only like I could only go onto my normal account and just delete my PTU um, profile and then I had to create another one and so that worked obviously so yeah so I've enjoyed being on it the, the colours do seem a bit richer for some reason I'm not sure why it just does feel it does feel nicer um, just some issues with everything else basically so there we go let's have a look what we've got going on here have I got my lights on I think I have dark here. I'm going to come in and struggle to land it a little bit here because obviously trying to trying to um, I'm, I'm still used to move the controls I'm trying to remember the controls that I got to use do is just land near the thing over here oh just around here so if I can come down here around here somewhere too bothered about getting back <coughs> I just want to get out and sell this stuff cool and away we go so I just want to see what the, the refactor is like 
on the selling side of it now. Um, I'm liking the new uh, tooltips. They're pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Put my torch on. This place is like death sometimes. I'm not too bothered about that and where it is and that. I just... Um, want to sell this. So it looks like, yeah, it's all in different containers on this one. That's pretty cool. So I'm going to go in here now and sell it. See what we got in, in here going on. And there we are, another console. Looks pretty cool. I'm liking that. So we're going to here and we're going to go to... Got nothing in stock here. There's nothing in demand. So we got to my So we got to my whole air. And we're gonna go to that cell actually. And then we're gonna go to the whole air. Whole air. So I've got to get used to this now, aren't I? So what am I selling? I'm selling ETAM. So it's not let me sell. Set, set my inventory. So let me come off this and back on it. Let's see what we've got again. Gonna take some getting used to the new. So we'll go to that and we're gonna sell. Okay. Miss colour here. There we are. Cargo grid. And we're gonna sell. All of this lot. Etam. This is all in demand. <laughs> ah, there we are. So there we are. There's the in demand uh, Etam. And oh, we should sell here. I, I see. Now, so we go to the buy here. So this is all our inventory, and this is their inventory. So I get it. I, I'm. So, I, I get it now. This is this is what we've got, and this is what they've got. Okay. So we've got this. Uh, we can tell, sell ten for 115 grand. So we're getting it at full price, which is 11.5. Um, so that's the normal price, uh, full price that we sell it at. Da -da -da -da, like that. Cool. Processing order. Accept. So we've got 116 grand. We've got that left now. But it doesn't tell me. Like the old system used to tell me what the cargo was worth. Maybe if I press that. The old system used to tell me at the bottom what my cargo was worth. At the current price that we sold. And but this isn't this isn't doing that, so Yeah, I'm not too sure why. I don't know if there's gonna be more going on with this, but select subcategory. I go grid, ETAM. Yeah, so no demand, that's it. It just says no demand now. So in demand and cannot sell. So yeah, I get it. I understand it now. The left side is what we've got. The right side is what they've got and they're buying and selling. So this is what they're buying. Oh, is that what we buy? Yeah, no, that's what we buy and that's what's in demand. So you can see what's in demand here. No demand, ETAM. And we got 10 SCU of it. Ten thousand SCU of construction materials and souvenirs and part and part of favors.
Unless there's somebody else around that's got yeah, that stuff in there, so I don't know. God knows what these are, but. Widow on and. Ah! Is that what's in demand in this area? Or is it just what's in demand in the, everything? Yeah, I think it might be what's in demand of everything, like just around the areas. It's got no demand of my ETAM at the moment. It's going to take a little bit of getting used to, I think. This must be more pages. It's going to take a little bit of getting used to uh, figuring this stuff out. So I'm presuming this is where we buy and this is what they sell but what's in demand but how many they will have of it <coughs> right let's pull away from this have a look at the ship and that beautiful beautiful park in there that looks new over there this does look new, this here. I don't think this was here before. Yeah, this wasn't here before. So they've done some work here. It doesn't look the same as it did. I'll tell you that. Definitely doesn't look the same as it did. They look a little different as well. So I don't know, I don't know if... Like they just haven't changed stuff on this one from the from the other one here, but yeah, this definitely is different because I don't think this was here before. This thing here, this engine. Yeah. So let's go back in. Let's see again on this system. Right, so in demand, no demand, can't sell. That's nothing in that one. And then we've got some hull air. And then we go to uh, cargo grid. And nothing is not in demand again. We just have to wait for that to come available again. I'm not too sure what this this cell his this cell here is. Because if we've got this here then I'm not too sure what this sells for. Is it just what we can sell in this in this world, basically? So I need to know more about this section here. Because obviously we can't I don't think as far as I know we can't sell this stuff here. Unless we can. Oh yes, we probably can sell this stuff here. So this is all the stuff we can sell here. I get it. Stop being silly, Tony. This is the stuff we can sell here. So they're out. I get it. So they're out of stock of all this lot. So there's going to be a demand for it. But they've got this much of this, this, and this here in stock. Right. I get it now. <laughs> silly. Yes, okay. And then there's no demand here, which is what we've got. So, yes. This is what we can buy here, and this is what we can sell here. And then this is what stock is here. So, they've got 10 SCU of stock here. So, I have to wait for that to go down to, to 6 before I can sell this 4. <coughs> That's... That's the cut and dry of it, I think. I have to wait for this to go down to six, so I can sell that four. Yes. There we are. Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. I get it. That's one of my favorite ships there. So I love my Hull Air. This is a pledge ship. And I've also got the Pisces are 
rescue one. Uh, Tony, you're so silly. You can't even put your landing gear down. You're so stupid sometimes. Uh, let me put my landing gear down. Bet you was all laughing at me earlier, like, stupid idiot, Danny put his landing gear down. That's because I'm just so confused, like, with, with what's going on. Like, just that, my movements and stuff like that. Right, let's put this landing gear down. A bit better. Landing successful. <laughs> I do like that. I like the, the the extra bits like the takeoff and the landing successful and uh, and you know stuff like that. I do like that. The, the extra little touches to it. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I do like it. And those little things. I love the the the, the move all but um So it looks like the wait time on this is pretty much the same as it was. So, yeah. All right, so let's have a look. So, what do we got in demand? Anything we've got in demand? Nothing here. I need to back off because that's not working. Let's choose. Oh yeah, must miscall air in demand, no demand, in demand. So there we are. We've got the four here. So let me have a look here, quickly. So the in demand and the no demand. So the no demand now is gone, and if we go down to um what I've got, which is ETAM. E, e. So it's saying they've got no stock now, so I could sell another 10, basically. Is what they're saying. So I've got four, and I can sell that. 46 grand. So I made 40 grand in that run. I know, like, it doesn't really matter at the moment. But, so low inventory, yeah. So, yeah, I get it now. I get how this works. So, that's this run. So, I'm going to head back up to this space station um, and then log out. But, for me, so my first thoughts on this is I'm liking the little extra um, things like the landing complete and all that stuff. I'm loving all that little bit, little things. I'm loving the little... Uh, extra icons. Um, I like how it now f you can when it lights up when you press your F key or your focus key to To focus in on stuff on here. You can see them much better They're you know, they don't only light up once you're near them So yeah, I like how they light up clearer. There's a, it's just so much clearer So I like that that's that's pretty cool. I like the cargo refactor and let me just get going. May die yet? Yeah. Um, launch sequence complete. So there we are. And let me get back inside. We'll put that on there and zoom that up. And I'm just going to head to the space station and log out. But. I like the little bits like that that they've added in. The colours do seem a little bit richer, so that's pretty cool. And the cargo refactor is pretty cool. Now you can see the stock fully, so you you can, so you understand more why they're out of stock. So I'll say, if I did this run and somebody else had sold Etam, I could see that there was out of stock of Etam because some because they already had stock in or low stock or medium stock or whatever. So you can see it better on the on the right hand side. That so that's much better for me. Um, I like the odd little bits that they've, they've added. I do like that, the, the little, say like the um, the launch sequence complete and the landing complete and stuff like that. I do like all of that. Um, obviously there's bugs, but we're going to expect that. 
you know, not it's not going to be a perfect um, thing. So. enjoyed it. I've enjoyed the the hour or whatever I've had on it. And um yeah it's been it's been a good one. So I'm gonna head back and log off and we hope you enjoyed this one guys. I made 40 grand um so the so the run's pretty much the same uh, it's just that the, the refactoring of it is a lot better. It seems a lot better. And the fact that you had to pull out your spine to uh, actually be able to put cargo on, which is more realistic to me. Um, it'd be nice to see people put in some comments below on what you think. And if you've done any cargo runs with something else, like a caterpillar and... Um, or like the C2 or anything like that. What's the difference? So you do, is there anything you have to do specifically with them? Like, do you have to open up the sides? Um, anything like that? Do you have to open up your... Do you have to open up your bay doors on the C2? And like I said, the sides on the... Um, oh, let me just turn that off because I'm going to crash into that. Uh, do you have to turn up your, you know, the take the sides stuck down on the caterpillar? So if you guys can let me know that in the comments, if any of you've got a caterpillar, I've got a caterpillar, but I bought it in game, so and it's not giving me here. So, um, yeah, it'd be good to know this uh, what you guys have come across, uh, and where I had to do that spine there. What's, I want to know what, what people have to do with other stuff. What? Ah, uh, it's not. I better take that off, actually. Make sure I take that self-destruct off. It shouldn't be on. Some of the sounds are pretty good. I can hear little sounds going on, and that they're pretty cool. I'm going to contact ATC. Please proceed to assigned landing bay. Space station looks a little bit different. That request has already been granted. Uh, those little, I don't know if you can hear them, but they pretty, sound pretty cool. There's the bay we're going to, so let's get the gear down this time, not mess around with this. Landing gear down. I need to pull the spine in as well. Just let me do that, let's get that spine in. I don't know if there's a shortcut for it, there probably is, but I'm going to do that. Let's retract that. Get a better view of where we're going. Please proceed to assigned landing bay. Attention. Please come to an immediate halt and hold for your vessel to be scanned. Come on in, scan me. Scan me, scan me, scan me. There he is. I like the little sounds, they're pretty cool. Impressed with that. Okay, thanks. Cool, that's <laughs> that's pretty cool, I like it. I like it. So my controls are switched again. Now <laughs> <laughs> now the um, the the spin round is where it should be, except now without the um, I've got to press I don't press the button, so I need to go back to where I pressed the button. Now, so basically my move forward is not moving forward. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I don't know what's going on with this thing. I really don't. Wow. I like the little flash. I don't know if it's a bug, but I actually like that. Where it all flashes on when you come back in like that. When like that, but like that. 
I do like that. It might be a bug, but... It might not look it, but I am actually struggling with it, with the movements of it. Landing successful um, vocalization and that, not just by the ATC, but by by me, by my ship. So yeah, so some of the stuff I've observed is that I've like I like the cargo refactor and and have been able to see the stock now. I like the little um, new uh, icons like that that shows you. I like the green bits on when you're focusing on the ship, and I also like the move all button. That we've got in the inventory now. That that's a game changer for me, because being able to move a ton of stuff. Like, say, if I was in here and I had so much stuff in my ship over here, and I wanted to move it over to my local, I, it takes you ages. Just you're moving it, you're moving it, you're moving it, you're moving it. Whereas now you just go move all, boom, done. That is a game game changer for me. Oh, I like that as well. That's pretty cool. Yes, I do like that. I'm going to keep that on, probably. Yeah, I do like that. Tells me where I can have stuff. That's pretty cool. In that there. Your filters, they all look the same. And you've got that there now as well. I don't know if that was always there. But yeah, so my thoughts on it. Pretty impressed up to yet. I want to do some more stuff with it. But... Uh, as far as what I've got up to yet, or what I see up to yet, it'd be nice if I could use my trigger to trigger that. And I like how it's a pointer like that now and not like the little arrow that you used to get. I like the pointer thing, different pointers rather than the arrows. I do like that, that's a good change. So, yeah, I I'm impressed up to yet. There is issues with the, like I say, with the, excuse me, with the controls. But I'm not Welcome too bothered about to that. I'm not too bothered about system. that. Store that. This is here. My envelope is up here for some reason. Don't know why that is. Can I store that? It doesn't really matter. I'm not too bothered. Um, yeah, so pretty happy with how that went. And. Burrito bar. I'm going to have this burrito here. Can I grab that? Can I eat it? Yeah, I'm just going to eat somebody else's burrito. Yummy, yummy. Can I grab that? Yeah. Grab that drink. Can I have that drink. Somebody else. Let me have. No, I can't have that because else is uh, big. Let's buy a can. Let's see if that is any better. There we are. Yeah, it's cool. 
Cool, cool, cool. Happy with that. Got that. Put it on the floor. Cool. So that's me. I'm going to get off and let somebody else have a chance. I've been on long enough. And, um, yeah, my thoughts is, is it done, it's done well. I'm really liking the new cargo factor and, and the odd little bits here and there makes it worthwhile for me. So we hope you like that one, guys. If you did like that one, don't forget to uh, take that pointer. Tickle that like button, guys. And don't forget to hit that bell and subscribe notification for more videos as we drop them. I try my hardest to try and get as much good content out as we can. And sometimes there can be some boring content. But I still want to try and keep content coming of just gameplay. Um, as well as, you know, other things as well. Like uh, how-tos and stuff like that. So, yeah, we hope you like that one, guys. And we'll see you out in the verse.